Morning, even afternoon, we got a banger for y'all today, baby. What we got for you here is me putting myself to the test, specifically a solar system test. Now, I'm not the brightest bulb in the pack, and I think y'all are gonna see why when you watch this. If you do enjoy this, drop a like, share it with a friend, sub, ring bell. Most importantly, be sure to tell somebody you love them. All right, I'll catch you in the next one. Okay, click on Earth. Um. I thought Earth was tiny. Aren't we small? I mean, this looks like Earth, but I thought Earth was like the smallest thing in our solar system. It's okay. That is Earth. Okay, click on Jupiter. I I believe that Jupiter is. I think Jupiter is like one of the big ones. I think. Um, I'm pretty sure it's one of the big ones. I can't remember. I I can't remember. I I think that. I, I want to say this is Jupiter. I, I think this is Saturn. I'm pretty sure Saturn has the ring around it. Although is Jupiter red? No, Mars is red, bro. Cause we're trying to go to Mars, bro. I'm going, I think this is Jupiter. Oh my God, I'm right. Okay, click on Uranus. I was just going to stand up and bend over. <laughs> uh, Uranus, uh, no idea. I, I just, this is where, I, I think this is where I'm going to start to get stun locked. I want to say Uranus is kind of tiny and I don't like I'm pretty sure Jupiter is the biggest one in our solar system and I think this is Saturn I think that's Saturn but it's like I, I don't like I the, they put colors on these planets like I'm so, like I look at these planets every night and I know what the colors are I mean is Uranus tinier than, what is smaller than Earth bro like I, I don't even understand what this could be I'm gonna kind of I think this is Mars I'm gonna kind of wild card here and I'm gonna say Uranus is down here that's Mercury. What? Is this Uranus? Wait, what? Are you, is it? How the fuck am I supposed to know that, bro? Like I'm supposed to look at that little blue orb and be like, oh yes, of course, Uranus. <laughs> Quiet. <laughs> um, okay, Venus. Well, I know it's not one of these two and I think that's Saturn. So I'm gonna go Venus. <laughs> you kidding me 50 percent. okay i want to make sure i pass this okay okay wait this was mars this was no 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 wait this was Mar it has to be this right this has to be venus neptune neptune i just found one of these neptune was <sighs> neptune um okay all right just everyone just oh my guys my fingers are itchy right now please don't look at me uh okay i, I think I think I clicked on that and I'm pretty sure this was Neptune. As, as long as I get a 65 or above, that's considered passing in high school. So if I can get a 65 on this, I'd be pretty happy. Right now we're at 57. Um, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go. I think I clicked here. Mercury. Mercury was the small one. I don't know, this is Mars cause it's red, right? Mercury, Saturn. Oh my God, I passed Mars. Let's fucking go, bro. 73% I passed, get fucked, okay? A lot of you probably doubted me out there. I want you to know that, I passed. 73% I passed the solar system, dude. That was painful. What? <laughs> what do you mean that was painful? I got 73% that's passing. How, how are any of you gonna say that that was a painful experience, dude? 73% in school, I passed. And hey, listen, guys, okay? You're acting like before I go to bed every night, I step outside and I look up in the sky and think about our solar system, man. I've talked about this. I, I don't think about our galaxy. I don't think about our solar system because all it does is kind of just stress me out, bro. Like I can look out there and I can just look forever. It goes to eternity. It just it just goes forever. And 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 like that one comedian said, it's constantly getting larger. That doesn't and, and he said it doesn't make sense. And he's right. It doesn't make sense. How does something get larger? That's infinite. It's an infinite area that is getting larger and there's black holes out there that just suck shit up, bro. What if What if right now I'm vibing, right? All of a sudden it just gets really dark out, fucking black hole. You know what I mean, dude? I'm really not trying to get on this tangent again. The point, I, guys, I, the point I'm trying to make is like when I sit and think about, I don't think about the solar system a lot, okay? And when I do, it kind of just stresses me out a little bit. I did not cheat. I, I, I I, you know, I might not have done that at the speed of which some of you did it. I'll say that some of you might have done better than me and that's fine. 
I've already openly said I'm dumb, okay? I was homeschooled for a couple years. I love I love my 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 ma. May she rest in peace. I don't think I learned very much in homeschool. I didn't. Here's how my homeschool day went. I woke up around eight o'clock. We would have some breakfast. We did school till about 12, 1230. We'd get all the work done. And then I would play Counter-Strike 1.6 until my friends got home from school. And I'd grind some Counter-Strike or some Team Fortress Classic. And uh, speaking, I'm speaking to the older generation here talking about those games when I was like 13, 14 years old. And then I would, my friends would get back from school at like 2, 2.30 and I, I, and then I'd go play with them. That was my day. And my mom, she, I think my mom knew I was stupid. You know what I mean? Like she knew. She would try and help me out by like, she would like be like, okay, Timmy, do your homework. I have to go use the bathroom. And then she would just like go away and just leave the book of answers in front of me. Like, like... Like she knew I was stupid. She knew it. And she, you know, she called me and, and my dad said this about me too. He goes, Tim, you're, you're a social butterfly. You're a social butterfly. My dad, he's a very smart man, very math. I, I, I used to like, I used to throw numbers out to my dad when he was driving. I was like, all right, dad, what's 75 minus 20 times four. And my dad would like, I mean, he could have been wrong for all I know, but he was like figuring that out. You know, he would like do it in his head. And I was like, dude, my dad's so smart. And then my my dad, he kind of he, he kind of realized as I got older that I was pretty dumb. He started to just set the bar lower, which was great for me. So basically what he did was when I was younger, probably like fifth, sixth grade, seventh grade, my dad's like, all right, Tim, you got to get A's. And then, you know, eighth grade rolls around, ninth grade rolls around. He goes, all right, Tim, let's get some, let's get some, maybe a B minus. Let's go for like, you know, let's see a B minus report card. Let's see, you know, and then, and then we got to like 10th and 11th grade. And my dad's like, all right, Tim, let's just get like a C. Let, let's just try and lock in a C here. And finally, by my senior year, bro, he was just happy if I was passing and I had a D. And it's at that point, it's like, Tim, just, just graduate. You know what I mean? That's all he was telling me. So he figured out and my mom figured out pretty early on that I was not, I was, I was a social butterfly. I, I love playing video games and I, 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 I was, you know, friends with a lot of people and I can hang out with anyone and, you know, spend some time. And I was just pretty stupid. So when I do stuff like this solar system test, it shouldn't show you, it shouldn't be a shock to you that I'm dumb, okay? I've said that a lot, I'm very stupid. I'm stupid, I'm stupid! You know, not for nothing though, I'll never forget this, bro. And then I'm gonna move on after this little story with my dad. Not for nothing, I still remember this like it was yesterday. My dad, my dad is a very smart man, a right? chemical engineer. I was in chemistry class. On our way to school, my dad drove me to school, okay? And we would get Dunkin' Donuts every morning, I would have two cream cheese bagels and a large coffee colada. That's how I started my day, 2,500 calories. Sent it, no wonder I was fat. We're, we're driving after Duncan and we're on the way to school and it hits me. I didn't do my chemistry homework. I was like, oh my God. And, it, I, and I told my dad, I was like, dad, I didn't do my chemistry homework. And if I don't turn this in, I could fail. I don't know if that was true, but I told him it. He goes, Tim, he lets out this big sigh and he goes, Tim, why do you do this to yourself? And I said, Dad, if it's any consolation, I'm not too sure. He goes, all right, read off the questions. I pull out my homework and I just start reading my homework questions to my dad. I'm like, all right, Dad, what is the chemical formula for A, B, little C, whatever the fuck. I can't even think of any of the questions right now, okay? So we, my, I pull it out and I just, and my dad, he is rattling the answers off, bro. Rattling them off. Like, oh yeah, that, just put this in here, put this in here, circle this, it's, it's, it's B, it's C, blah, blah, blah. My dad, we do all of the homework and we get, and I turn it in. Two days later, I get my chemistry homework back. I failed. I, got, I had like a 60 or something. The teach, my teacher gives me my homework. I'm like, how in the fuck? That's, here's what I'm thinking. I didn't say this a lot. I'm like, how in the hell? Did I fail this? My father, who's a chemical engineer, gave me the answers. I go home to my dad that night and I'm like, dad, look at my chemistry homework. And I show him that we got a 60. And his exact answer to me, his exact answer to me was, and I quote, that shit's too easy. I don't use it anymore. And he walked out. And that was the last we talked about it. That was it.
even to this day i haven't i haven't i haven't talked to him about it since since that that was a lot that was like the last conversation we had i was like dad we got a 60 and he goes that shit's too easy and just walked out and uh yeah dude and I, I was like <laughs> i was like i was like how are you this this you're a you're a, an engineer in the chemical field and i am failing my chemistry homework dude you know what i mean i don't know how i got to that story off of me doing that uh that test of the solar system the bottom line here's kind of the and this the long short of everything i just said i have always been very stupid and i probably will always be very stupid and thank you for watching so i can you know do what i do so <laughs>